Hey guys, it's Bro you Whack, and today I got a very interesting video for you guys because the other day there was actually a Halloween comic release for the 2017 Junkenstein's Revenge game mode, and while this game mode really isn't really story driven, even though it, it's kind of narrative as if it was, there's not really this big in-depth story when compared to maybe even the Uprising event or just the whole Overwatch story, but this brand new comic just kind of introduces the four brand new heroes, which was Torbjorn, uh, Zenyatta, Widowmaker, and Genji, and just how they kind of go and why they're defending the castle. Again, it's a very small comic, but I will link it down in the description below in case you haven't seen it because of the artwork, man. It's just so awesome. I just love Blizzard and just the little extra things they do. They're like guacamole. They're hella extra, but either way, one thing I wanted to focus on was actually this Genji skin because when they actually showcased the four brand new heroes along with Symmetra, they actually included their brand new skins except for Widowmaker. So if we look at Symmetra, Torbjorn, and Zenyatta, all three of those skins were in the Halloween event. Widowmaker, she has her uh, uh, Corterra skin. I, I forgot the name of it, but it's pretty much just her base legendary skin that she got day one of the game. But then we focus on Genji, and he kind of has this like more Asian traditional outfit. He has like this hat that you would see people that are working in the fields just wearing to block well the sun from hurting their heads and whatnot. And he also has this robe. But you also notice that his mask thing isn't really covering his face, more or less just his chin area. The main point I'm trying to make here is like, okay, we have all the skins here. Like we're looking at Roadhog, we're looking at Reaper, we're looking at Torbjorn. Everyone has their Halloween skins except for Widowmaker but it's not a Halloween skin and neither does Genji but that's not even a skin that he has just in general now the reason for making this video is because I want to introduce the idea it's like okay are they gonna bring a skin like this because you guys have to realize there's been tons of other skins uh, shown in comments not skins more or less just like certain outfits for certain heroes that could easily be a skin one skin idea that I had that really isn't talked about which I mean I don't blame people because maybe this would be a lame skin but in the Uprising comic Winston had like a scientist outfit he was wearing a white coat he looked like well what he is he's a scientist so why doesn't he get a uh, scientist skin like they depicted him in the overwatch comic and same thing here it's kind of weird that this is like a story based comic they they show him in a different outfit why didn't they include it in the Halloween events now one theory that people are coming up with is the same theory that people came up with McCree is that they had the skin available last year because it was apparently data mined but they didn't bring it till next year because maybe it wasn't cool enough maybe they wanted to add on to it or maybe they had enough skins that that's the one that they scrapped for next year. Maybe that's the case for Widowmaker. Maybe that's why uh, she didn't get a skin because maybe next year she would. But the only problem that I have with that idea for uh, this possibly coming for maybe the 2018 Halloween event with Genji finally getting the skin is that it's in 2018. Like, how are you going to tease us with this skin and not include it for a whole entire year? So for my idea, the reason why I'm making this video is what if they were to have like an event where they just release a bunch of just random skins? Because they kind of did that with Reinhardt when Eichenwald came out now obviously that is like a German map he's the only German hero in the game so they're gonna give him a few skins to celebrate hey we're releasing a brand new map here's a brand new skin for Reinhardt but what if they were just to do something different where maybe they have the May skin remember the cinematic short for May where she was like in this like red outfit this this cute little hat you know why don't they have that also in this little mini event same thing with the Genji skin maybe they can even include this Reinhardt skin that's in this comic he's wearing like a little crown it's sort of like the unmasked skin already, but just some ideas I can throw out there. Along with the Overwatch lore skin ideas that I'm always constantly bringing up, like why don't they just have an event where they just release a bunch of random skins? You guys also have to remember the Overwatch World League skins. So remember the May skin for the Shanghai Dragons and then the San Francisco team, I think it was Doomfist, and then another hero, it totally uh, just released from my mind, I don't remember, I will put a screenshot. They also will be announcing a ton of Overwatch World League skins, so my idea is like, even though it probably isn't event worthy, why don't they just pair the Overwatch World League skins with these other in-game lore skins and just release them to the public and maybe just make them into their own loot box, maybe have them just in the base loot box, whatever it could be. I don't really care. I just want them in the game. I want to have a chance to be able to get them. You know, it's a very small idea, but it's still still cool nonetheless. When you see a Genji skin like that, some people might say, oh, well, the hat really doesn't fit his head description or his head diaphragm, so people will get thrown off were to actually shoot for the head. But Mercy didn't have a hat but she got the Witch Mercy skin, so I don't see that as being a big problem. Overall, the reason why I'm making this video is to get your guys' thoughts, because maybe you don't care for this. Maybe you don't want this Genji skin, even though he's looking so dope. I mean, he's just posing for the camera, even though he's not trying to. He's like, dang, yo, 
Somebody snap a pic right now. I'm just trying to get some likes on Instagram. All jokes aside though, that's why I'm making this video because I seriously do want to hear guys' thoughts. Uh, but I just love seeing these different depictions from Blizzard because, well, hey, this would totally work in the game. Like I mentioned before, Mercy did get that big old witch hat, so I don't see this being a pretty big problem for Genji. And plus, you know, people love Genji or people hate him either way. So, I mean, I don't see a lot of people complaining if he did get the skin. But along with that, also uh, the May skin or just outfit, it's not really confirmed to be a skin but a lot of people are wanting that or maybe a Winston skin or maybe just other heroes that you see in the comics please let me know what you would like to see along with the Overwatch World League since I, I need that mace I know I'm freaking out over May so I love you guys thank you guys for watching more Overwatch videos to come hopefully more idea videos to come before season 7 starts because I love making these videos I just get distracted with the actual game uh, but I love you guys thank you guys for watching more Overwatch videos to come and bye